Are you planning your next vacation in New Zealand? Not sure where to go in this southwest corner of the Pacific Ocean? In this island country, you can enjoy modern cities, long forests, majestic mountains, glaciers, volcanoes, and beautiful beaches. Stay with us and discover the 10 best places to visit in New Zealand. But before we get started, subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. Number 1. Mount Cook If you're a lover of heights, you'll be amazed by this destination. Mount Cook is the highest mountain in all of New Zealand. To reach this peak, you must visit the Aoraki Mount Cook National Park. A mountain range runs along the entire west coast of the South Island of New Zealand. Near this mountain, you can visit some alpine lakes and enjoy the view of the spectacular Tasman and Hooker glaciers. Mount Cook has a long history of mountaineering and is a favorite destination for climbers. This location was used to recreate Mount Caradhras in the first Lord of the Rings movie. Number 2. Abel Tasman National Park Do you want to enjoy the beaches of this beautiful country? There are many, and if you ask New Zealanders, each one will recommend a different one. However, we think your best option is to visit the Abel Tasman National Park. Here, you'll find beautiful destinations to enjoy golden sands and turquoise waters. In this place, Kai Teri Teri Beach, Awaroa Beach, and Torrent Bay really stand out. If you travel to this park, be sure to visit the Observation Beach campsite. Number 3. Hawks Bay Are you a lover of fine wines? This country produces some of the best grape varieties in the entire world. There is the classic New Zealand wine trail, where you can tour the most famous vineyards. Hawks Bay is the first stop on this route and is known as the wine region. You can take a bike tour through the vineyards. Most of the region's wineries and several artisanal producers are connected by 200 kilometers of cycling trails. In this region, you can visit the towns of Napier and Hastings, famous for their Art Deco architecture. Other tourist destinations are Lake Wakaramona and Te Mata Peak. Number 4. Milford Sound A visit to New Zealand would not be complete without seeing Milford Sound. The writer Rudyard Kipling described this place as the eighth wonder of the world. That's why it's the most popular tourist destination in all of New Zealand. Milford Sound is a fjord located southwest of the South Island of New Zealand in the Fjordland National Park. Milford Sound is breathtaking in any weather. Cliffs rise from the dark waters and mountain peaks touch the sky. The best ones are the waterfalls up to 1,000 meters. If it rains, the cascades multiply and acquire a magnificent effect. You can tour the place by boat, go kayaking, diving, or take a helicopter flight. Number 5. Bay of Islands This gorgeous region is made up of 144 islands between Cape Brett and the Perua Peninsula. One of the best places to go in New Zealand for fishing, sailing and other water sports. What's there to do in the Bay of Islands? Get on or in the water. Try scuba diving. You'll be ferried far out into the bay to explore a whole new underwater world. Or get up close and personal with the marine life in the Bay of Islands on a Fuller's Great Sights hole in the Rock Dolphin Cruise. On a good day, you'll see both whales and dolphins on this cruise. The cruise will take you to one of the Bay of Islands most famous sites, the Hole in the Rock. You can sail through this rock formation's unique opening when the tide is right. Number 6. Waitomo Glowworm Caves Cave lovers have good reason to visit New Zealand. In the Waitomo region, there is a marvelous place to explore. At Waitomo Glowworm Caves, you can observe stalactites and stalagmites. However, the greatest spectacle is the galaxy of native fireflies that decorate the walls of these caves. 
you can visit this place on a walking tour or by boat. If you're adventurous, we advise you to experience cave navigation where you will move, swim, and float in a rubber chamber. There is also the option of descending into the darkness by rappelling or ziplining. You can't miss this wonder of nature. Number 7. Fox and Franz Joseph Glaciers Don't miss this opportunity to visit one of the most accessible glaciers in the entire world. Fox Glacier descends through the Southern Alps to the Temperate River Forest, which is only 300 meters above sea level. Don't settle for a close-up view of this glacier. Join an ice hiking adventure and explore the whole place. Near Fox Glacier is Lake Matheson, one of the most photographed places in New Zealand. Franz Joseph Glacier is 12 kilometers long and is located in Westland National Park on the west coast of the South Island. This great river of ice also descends from the heights to the forest. You can take a guided tour on the Franz Joseph Glacier. However, if you prefer, you can take a helicopter tour to admire the magnificence of both glaciers. The area surrounding the two glaciers is listed as a World Heritage Site. Number 8. Tekapu Lake this is one of the most beautiful and picturesque locations in New Zealand. A dream place for any photographer. Lake Tekapu is located in the north of the Mackenzie Basin, a three-hour drive from Christchurch. The snow-capped mountains, the beautiful church, and the turquoise lake will captivate you. The color comes from the fine glacial flower, glacially ground rock suspended in the water. Want to see the southern lights? In Lake Tekapu, you can do it. The ideal spot to see this spectacle is from the Mount John Observatory between April and September. Number 9. Tongari Ro National Park This is the oldest national park in New Zealand and is located in the middle of the North Island. It's home to the active volcanic mountains Rupehu Nuoahoy and Tongariro. Tongariro National Park is a mixed UNESCO World Heritage Site due to the mixture of culture and nature. You can visit several Maori religious sites within the park. Volcanic activity has worked wonders in this 80,000 hectares of the park. Emerald lakes, smoking craters, lava flows, colorful silica terraces and unique alpine gardens will amaze you. The beauty and diversity of the site are complemented by several spectacular waterfalls. Number 10. The Hobbiton Movie Set Any fan of The Lord of the Rings dreams of knowing the shrine. If you're one of them, you can't miss the village of Mata Mata. Here, you can take a guided tour of the 44 unique Hobbit holes. What else can you see on this tour? You'll visit the Green Dragon Pub, the Mill, the Double Arch Bridge, and the famous Feast Tree. If you don't like these movies, you can still enjoy the fabulous cafes throughout the town. Spectacular lodging and farm tours are also available in Mata Mata. When you leave this town, you can visit Wairiri Falls, the highest waterfall on the North Island with a drop of 153 meters. From there, you can enjoy great views of the valley and the Wakato lowlands. New Zealand, a country where you can find untamed wilderness to rich culture, towering mountains and mist-cloaked fjords, beautiful golden beaches curled around quiet bays. Start packing and make your next dream destination here in New Zealand. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and click subscribe. Thanks for watching.